Hi everybody, here's a nifty trick to help you use apostrophes to show ownership. Let's have a look at some examples. Here we have a question that you need to commit to memory. Who owns the whatever? Let's have a look at this example. The boy's cape is a vibrant red. Who owns the cape? this boy here so the boy owns the cape put your apostrophe after boy what about here the boy's soccer ball had a hard life who owns the soccer ball the boys in this picture do the boys own the soccer ball i'm putting my apostrophe after boys What about here? The men's toilets had ugly orange doors. Who owns the toilets? The men own the toilets, so my apostrophe goes after men. We all love the children's playground. Who owns the playground? The children own the playground so put your apostrophe after children now you'll notice that at no stage am i thinking oh does it go before the s or the af or after the s this apostrophe all i do is i ask my magic question it works every time let's have a look at another example who owns the mountain bike so kim's mountain bike is unusual who owns the mountain bike Kim owns the mountain bike. My apostrophe goes after Kim. So just to recap, here's your question. Who owns the whatever? Commit it to memory. Your apostrophe goes after the answer to this question. Okay, so I hope that little tip stops any problems that you might have in the future with where to put your apostrophe to show ownership.